Fuck! No! We just found out that uh, Emily jumped off a building and killed herself because she couldn't go to college. Damn. That's so unfortunate. That really is sad. Trash room. Oh god. <laughs> this is all your fault. Everything. You heartless bitch! You stole my only friend. My place in this world. All of it. You don't even care. I'm invisible to you. I fucking hate you. You're not talented. You're not special. You call those shit stains art? Come out of nowhere and ruined everything. Fuck off, fuck off, fuck off, fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. Get the fuck out of my life, you piece of shit freak. Damn! <laughs> Who wrote this? <laughs> Let's get the fuck out of there. Ew, feet. <laughs> Let's go this way. not creepy at all. <laughs> it's a school? Oh man, sometimes I miss high school. What is this? MLC. Don't know what that stands for. Space. Get that shit out of here! <laughs> Witch locker. Witch's locker. I can't tell if that's like mean or nice. Can't go that way. Can't go this way. This way it is. Ooh. <laughs> Damn, these people are tall. Or am I just short? <laughs> Excuse me. Fuck you. <laughs> Damn. Threw a shoe at me? <laughs> Go away. There's no shot people do this because I've been in high school. Nobody does this. <coughs> Freak, no wonder nobody likes you. Carry cursive. <laughs> This my locker. Oh. What the hell? Get out, you freak slut. Your art's fucking Her weary. Huh? You piece of shit. High school isn't like this, guys. I promise. What the fuck? <laughs> what the shit, dude? They're talking about you? This game is weird. Oh, is it gonna be another one of those run? Yep. 
outrun? Ew, all these eyes. Let's get the fuck out of here. Ah, 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 Find it. Find what? Find it. Just tell me what I'm looking for. Find it. Oh, what the fuck am I supposed to find? Jimmy 31st. I haven't really been in a good mood since this morning. I tried to lose myself in graffiti, but I wasn't feeling it. Maybe it's because mom and I argued this morning? Probably not. We've cl we've clawed we've clashed before. I've known this for I've known for a long time we value different things. Is it because my classmates tease me? I doubt it. They don't know me. They're just taking their issues out on someone. It's got to be because I lost that special person and the and the hope he gave me, right? Why do I feel like this? I've never felt like this before. The girl in this picture is Amelie. Amelie? That's her name? Amelie? What a fucking name. Y'all can y'all can pick between Amelia and Emily? Just Amelie? <laughs> this guy looks... They're hurt. Where are you going? Yeah. Oh, they're That's all dead. Right. They're all dead. <laughs> That's the point of this. Hmm? What's that? Oh, you like what you see? Come closer then. This is weird. Wait a sec. You two are from my class. Those glasses look good on you. <laughs> uh, sorry, she's so cute. That is a weird thing to say. I couldn't help myself. Oh, hey, it's me. Am I gay? Feel free to stop by any time. You're always welcome. <laughs> Am I gay or something? Maya only ever cared about Amelie. She didn't see me. I was invisible to her. That wasn't me? So you are obsessed with this chick? That's weird. <laughs> That your obsession? You're obsessed with this chick? <laughs> library. Uh, library. So I'm back at school. <laughs> Another cutscene. <laughs> There's no beauty. Any of this. Oh, I'm sorry. I 
was just thinking about something. I borrowed that book you wanted. I finished it, so it's all yours. my impressions in a letter. Uh-huh. Read it when you get home, okay? I won't. <laughs> Extremely confused about what's going on Where here. Was it? That book. Um, it'll be standing out or something, right? So, <sighs> not reading all that. Tell me, is this your curse? Find it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Find what in a place like this? The witch hunt. A witch's curse? Is that why I saw what I did before? Nothing over. Oh. Looks Hello. Like there's space for a book here. Wait, I think I know these. So, what, we gotta go find my locker and get the books? Hooray! Can we leave now? No way somebody's bully bullying her. I've She's pretty, there's no way. What the fuck? Are you alright, Inetta? Left me on red, so I was worried. Sorry, thinking about Maya. Not sure if you know the not sure if you know this, but Maya was bullied at school. I know. But she said she was okay. I figured I shouldn't push the issue. Then it was too late. Why didn't she say anything before she died? I wish she had talked to me. Maybe she didn't see me as a friend. That's not true. What the fuck is going on over here? <coughs> Take a little sippy sip. Mm -hmm. uh, what? I A R. Okay. Maya's locker. Jesus, there's oh, razor blades in it. It's not here. It wasn't here before either. I've never like seen this happen in school before, so. Why is it locked? Is there something I don't want to see? Let me get this straight. Your friend was getting bullied, and you were playing the poor me act. Shame on you. <laughs> oh, liar. I didn't even see the L. I'm a fucking idiot. <laughs> uh, 
Oh. Two? Go anywhere? Right, I see the number two. One. Okay, two, one, three, zero. So is it zero, three, one, two? Let's try that. Zero, three, one, two. I know what's inside. Hey! And I can't <laughs> look away. Here it is. It's a note. It's this letter. Was it inside the book? Okay. Remember when I said I wanted to live like a cherry blossom? <laughs> to be beautiful and dignified for a fleeting moment. Simply by letting go of life. Daring to bloom, knowing it won't last. And so falling in vivid color. I wish I could live like that. I want to experience true beauty. If only for a moment. I met someone who made me feel different. He showed me a whole new world. Gave me hope. I honestly thought he could help me find a new me. I felt it with all my heart. But people didn't understand us. Didn't want that from us. In the end, they took my hope from me. They took him away. People... People who can't achieve beauty seek comfort in others. They fear anyone different. Hate them. Try to tear them down. I can't take much more of this. I wish you and I had... I wish you and I could run away together. Not me. Just... Me and you. Wow. Asking Amelie for help, but I just uh... Amelie's locker. Maya, you have <laughs> everything. You're way more talented than me. So why, why take Amelie from me? You acted like I wasn't even there. Amelie is my friend. She's mine! What the fuck? <laughs> uh, I only wanted to take her down a bit. She she was taking Amelie away from me. She wouldn't pay attention to me. What the fuck is wrong with you? How was I supposed to know she'd actually kill herself? <laughs> what is wrong with you? So it's my fault she's dead. What the fuck is wrong with you? Jesus Christ, bro. This fucking bitch. There's the book. We need that, right? Yeah. Well, what are we supposed to do? It's all your fault. De fork. That's all your fault. Damn straight, it's all my fault. This bitch got jealous because her friend had another friend. What type of shit is that? She 
keep running, bitch. Oh, fuck! You want know fuck you, Anetta? Couldn't let your friends be happy. Fuck wrong with you. You got jealous because your friend made another friend. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Damn straight you should be sorry. What the fuck is wrong with this chick? Ah, fuck it happened again. Get away. Uh. For some reason, I thought there was another door. A bitch makes another chick kill herself because her friend was having another friend. That is the most jealous shit I've ever heard of. Open the door! Open the door, you stupid bitch! <laughs> ah! Ah! Through this door! I'm a fucking idiot, why'd I do that? Let's play Ring Around the Rosie. Play Ring Around the Rosie. Ha! Hua! 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 Ring Around the Rosie, bitch! Ha! Get your angle bong! Out of my way! It's all your fault. Ah, oh, fuck you, dumb bitch. Right here. Another right. Another left. To the door. Ah, shit. Ring around the roast, bitch. To the door. This door. It's all your fault. Fuck off. Yeah. This way. Yeah. Through this door. Yeah. Through this way. Don't run. Fuck off. I'm gonna run. Through here. Slow motion. Fuck off. What <laughs> turn? Another, another door to open. I did it! Ah, open the fucking door, you bitch! Get this, we got this. Get my, get my Nikes on. Lay, tighten my laces up. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna fucking die. We got this. We got this. We got this. I'm not even gonna go that far. I'm just gonna. Tua. This way. Then this way. A left. What, what, what the fuck? Okay, looks like we gotta have it chase me. Pop out the door. Pop out the door, there you go. Open the door! No time to do it, Eddie. Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, turn. Make another turn. Pick up the pace, you stupid bitch. Take my fucking laces. You never catch me. I'm too fast. Get away from me. Off I go. Dumb bitch. Keep running! Sprint, why are you jogging? That thing is on your ass! 
keep going, just son of a bitch! Oh, I'm sorry! Ah! Keep it pushing, bitch! Fuck that door. Get away, just keep running. Uh, up the stairs, up the stairs, up the stairs! <laughs> God, that's terrifying. <laughs> Are you gonna kill yourself again? You better fucking not. <laughs> Do you? I know what you wanted me to find. <laughs> Do you finally get it? Anita, what's up? I'm so sorry, Amelie. Maya died because I killed her. What are you talking about? You and Maya wrote letters to each other. Right? Yeah, but then Maya jumped off the villa roof. Well, there was supposed to be one in the last book you had, too. <laughs> what? That letter. <laughs> that letter was a message for you. Why are you telling me this, Anita? I was jealous of Maya. I was afraid she'd take you away from me. My mom was right. I should never have been born. Wait, wait, Anita. Yeah. Holy shit, what is this game? <laughs> Do a flip! Nope. Okay. One more go around. Is that my dead body? Oh shit! <laughs> Even if I die, this doesn't end. How many times do I have to go through this? I thought I found it. Find it. <laughs> I gotta get you to forgive me. Please tell me. Please, man, tell me. Don't we say anything? <laughs> All right, episode three. Um, wh where my dead body go? <laughs> so we found out it's our fault that that chick killed herself because I got jealous. Uh, fucking stupid. February fourth. I ended up heading to the roof of the villa. Couldn't help but think of the girl who jumped off to her death last year. Actually, a lot of girls killed themselves here. All teens, supposedly. Now the place is a famous spot for people to kill themselves. Looking down from the roof, I could see how high up I was. <coughs> Excuse me. The thought of the light breeze sending me flying made me feel a little queasy. Were they not scared? What was going through their heads? Why were they jumping away from something? Or to something? Or were they? Excuse me. Don't you dare go outside. <laughs> Don't you dare go outside tonight. Okay. <laughs> no future. Okay. Take my chances. <laughs> I 
Just shoot me in there, suck, your, suck it, bitch. <laughs> okay. Open. Where does this go? Another no exit. Oh, but I think we can. Nope. Oh, okay. No exit. No future. The Silent Hill phenomenon. Okay, here we go. The suicide rate has increased around the world, in large part due to struggle brought on by the COVID-19 pandemic. The country is still unsure how best to handle this issue. These trying times have also given rise to a strange phenomenon in many areas. Those affected suddenly claim to see fog, even a fair weather days, <clears throat> even on fair weather days. And lose consciousness shortly after. This has some. This has come to be known as the Silent Hill uh, phenomenon, named after a similar event occurred occurred in the uh, epon eponymous U.S. town. The first to propose a theory explaining why this could be happening is Doctor XXX, a social physiologist at XX University, who had the following to say that on the matter. To one who is psychologically unstable, fog represents uncertainty and serious illusion, or it's, or, I mean shit, uncertainty and sensory illusions. When in this state of high stress, one's vision may become obscured or tunneled, as if one is wandering through dense fog or mist. Societality, societal, societal, whatever, uncertainty, or uh, apprehension about the future manifest as fog, thus blurring the lines between illusion and reality. As time goes on, we are seeing more and more of cases of the Silent Hill phenomenon. In response, Dr. XXX calls for a rapid rebuilding of society, as well as a stra stronger f emphasis on a counseling and mental health care for the young. God damn it. Hmm. Phone's going on haywire. Controller's vibrating like crazy. The bass is getting super loud! Wait. Okay. Me and my mom lived here. This is our living room. The bathroom. No reflection. I hate it when games do this. They have no reflections. All in all, this isn't that bad of an apartment. You know? <laughs> it's another one of those creepy ass masks. <laughs> I'm guessing that's her mom. Um, what time is it? Let's see. I don't know, I can't read a clock. Why am I even trying? <laughs> wine. Two glasses. You drink wine with your mama? What was that? Oh, there's something over here. December 29th, 2011. I finally lost touch with him. I'll never see him again. I thought my, I found my happy ever after, happily ever after. But it was all a dream. However, I haven't lost everything. I still have my children. My cute little angels who light up my life. Is Amelia secretly her mom? <laughs> oh my god! I'm gonna come up with a theory. The theory is... Me and, uh... Maya is my sister and Amelia is my mom. And I got jealous of Maya being Amelia's favorite child, so I fucking killed her. That's my theory. That's what I'm gonna come up with. <laughs> Why won't you listen to a damn thing I say? Dishes are being piled up. February 10th, 2012. My new man showed up to my place today with a pizza. Children definitely need a father, but they still won't take to him. He looked annoyed when he left. I hope he doesn't hate me. February 22nd. 
Okay. This is like, a, what, 12 days? Yeah. My daughter drew a picture of our family. We were smiling and holding hands. I wish she could have drawn him as well. Maybe she doesn't realize him. Maybe she doesn't realize he might join our family. She's slower than the other kids her age. I'm sure she'll catch up and pass them soon enough. I know it. I know how to raise a child. I'm a good mother. I'm nothing like that heartless bitch who raised me. I won't fill my children with hate and fear. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure. This is her room. Alcoholism makes you very angry and more hostile. That's another reason why I don't like drinking. I'll drink occasionally here on, like, you know, special events, but I don't drink randomly. I don't like how I feel afterwards. March 7th, 2012. He showed up again with a smile on his face and a pizza in his hands for the new place he was raving about. <coughs> Excuse me. My daughter hated the pizza. I hated the pizza, though. She's extremely picky. I should probably teach her how to eat things she doesn't like. I know I was forced to eat things I hated when I was a kid, but I guess it has to be done. The kids finally blew up in front of him today. He was exhausted from work and said he just wanted to relax. He makes me feel so good, but I can't do the same for him. Maybe I'm not strict enough with them. We need him, to, we need him for a happy life, and I need them to realize that. I know it's probably a little harsh, but maybe if they don't see the light for a while, they'll finally see the light in him. Huh? April 12th, 2012, he told me banging on the closet door was making it hard for him to unwind. Oh my god! If they would just be quiet for a little bit, everything would be fine. What's wrong with them? He doesn't visit as much as he used to. If I don't figure something out, I may never see him again. You locked your children in the closet. Nah! I'd, I'd fight her. I'd actually fight her. Oh, I'm a little kid again. What the fuck? <laughs> My height. <laughs> oh my god. These trash bags are moving. May 9th, 2012. Everything seems to be going well now that we've been going out on dates. He was worried about my kids, so I bought them a bunch of books and toys. They should, they sh that should be enough to keep them occupied, right? I've been going out so much lately that I've left the place in a bit of a mess. I should clean it. But by the time I get back, I have no energy. I got contacted by the Children's Welfare Center. I guess some noisy bitch or asshole in my building reported hearing my children crying at night in my place. What the fuck do they know? He hasn't called me much lately. Am I yet destined to be alone? Or am I destined to be alone? Everyone else is out enjoying life while I'm working my ass off raising kids. Why am I the fucking bad guy? July 15, 2012. If I hadn't had children, maybe I'd be planning my summer vacation with my friends right now. Nothing matters anymore. I'm just crawling through life. I know what's going on in the closet, but I can't look. I just want to be happy. What's wrong with that? I'm done. The fuck is wrong with you? Stop. Oh, fuck. Mrs. Christina... Plan Eret. Plan Eret. We've reached out to you repeatedly, but you have yet to receive a response. We take this means you have no intention of remending this issue. You are in violation of German Civil Code, Article 1631, Section 2. Accordingly, the federal court has instructed you us to take your children. Should you have any obje objections to this, please contact us as soon as possible. Frank Fisher. Uh, children will fear. Good. Locked your children in a fucking closet. What is wrong with you? <laughs> Body found dead. And <gasps> no! Boy found dead in refrigerator. Mother arrested. August 4th, 2012. 
A boy was found dead today in a refrigerator at in the home of his 41-year-old mother, Person A, who was arrested by local authorities for hiding the body. Person A claims they have locked her son in the closet for more than a day to punish him. And when she noticed he wasn't moving the next morning, she hid his lifeless body in the refrigerator. Investigators are conducting an autopsy to determine the cause of death. According to the investigations, Person's A daughter ran to the neighbor's house to call the police and report her mother for neglect. When detectives arrived at the house, they discovered her brother's body in the refrigerator and arrested the mother after she confessed to her crime. Oh my god, I had a little brother. That's so fucked! So fuck, I'm so sorry you went through that. Oh my god. <laughs> You're wrong, Mom. I am your daughter. That's right, own up to that I'm shit. Just like you. God damn it. I'm cursed. I thought this would be your like, I'm your daughter, but I'm better than you. Nope, the poor me act's still going. Okay. <laughs> Why am I seeing this room here in the villa? I tried so hard to forget this place. Holy shit. Oh, no! Time to run. Oh shit, uh, dead end. Ah, oh, shit! Fuck you, bitch. Fuck you, bitch. You ain't catching me. I'm speedy motherfucking Gonzalez. Oh shit, she might catch me. Uh oh, uh oh. Dead end? No. I still got this. I still got this. I still got this. I still. Just turn right the fuck around. We'll go this way. We'll go in here. We'll go in here. Uh, all right. Uh, we went through that door, and we went that way. Uh, let's go this way. God damn it! Oh 
gonna keep this way it is Oh, I gotta find pictures to break the lock. You like what you see? Okay, 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 okay. We got this. We got this. We got this. What are you hiding inside? Stop s standing still, bitch. Fuck. This way. I've been here yet. Just turn right the fuck around. <laughs> uh, shit, where do I go? Oh, uh, fuck off! Stop standing still, girl! Dead end, dead end, dead end, dead end, dead end, dead end, dead end! Keep it pushing, keep it pushing, keep pushing! You ain't catching me today, bitch! Holla! We'll go this way. Oh, I found the last one! Where do I go? Where do I go? Where do I go? There? <laughs> I'm just opening it, preparing to open every door I can. Fuck. It's a dead end. No, it's not. Okay. I did it. Oh my god, I did it. Am I gonna be alone forever? Oh. That was intense. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Damn. All right, February 21st. It's been really absurd in my work lately. I decided to paint the girl who jumped off the villa roof. I'd like to think they left this place for something better. To think I'd finally be free from my despair. Because I've never felt this inspired. I've never felt this inspired. I'm going to put every last bit of myself into this piece. <coughs> Excuse me. My roof piece is almost done. I actually think, or I, it might actually be my crowning achievement but once this is done then what do i have it in me to come up with something even better how much longer can i enjoy the fame and praise that i get now uh, excuse me damn i'm burping a lot there's a spy there's despair and disappointment waiting for me right around the corner oh uh is okay the sadness has gripped me. Okay, the sadness that gripped me before has, cl has clawed its way back into my mind. I guess it was always there. Who knows how often it will show up? The thought makes me makes my skin crawl. Maybe I should just end things while I'm still happy. Go on a good note. I wish I could talk to someone about all this. Jesus. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> that was intense. Can we go back? It's locked. What's to do? Oh. March 13, 2022. At approximately 1 p.m. on the 12th floor, popular graffiti artist C.B. Maya Ako Heidenberg 
was found collapsed on the ground of an apartment in building uh, apartment building in Kent. She was pronounced dead at the hospital. The local death of an 18-year-old girl comes to, as a shock to not only local community members, but also all those who were familiar with her work. Authorities believe the cause of her death may be suicide, but given her popularity and the lack of warning signs to her peers, they have not ruled out, of, out foul play and, and are proceeding with a full-scale investigation. Wait. She killed herself half a year ago? Damn. And that means... I've been here this whole time. Wow. What will it take for you to forgive me? Please, end this. Maybe this is Just my hell. Let me die. <laughs> what? Is this... Me? Oh. Maybe I'm the one secretly drawing these. I want to show the hidden <laughs> side of girls. Their impulses. Their urges. Women scare me. What are you hiding inside? <laughs> Suicide. <laughs> I guess that's what she's Don't hiding. Worry about what people think. Me? I'm hiding in fear of women. name okay hear me out don't jump off the roof huh, huh? I, I know it's crazy right just how's about we take into consideration of not killing yourself yeah I know it's like the most wicked and popular thing that all the kids are doing but let's not do it yeah God, just don't do it. I, I, I swear to God, I swear, I swear to God. <laughs> it didn't matter. No matter what anyone had said, I didn't listen. Anita? <laughs> but you and Maya, both of you did see me. I should have figured that out sooner. Anita, wait. Where are you right now? Thank you. Amelie, you were always there for me. I'm... I'm going to go apologize to Maya now. Wait, Anita! Dude, just... Let's, let's just... Let's just think about this. How about you don't do it? Don't do it? Don't you fucking dare? Oh my god, I don't want to go back. Please. <laughs> Did I find it? Let's go shopping tomorrow. We can talk. Just two of us. Tell each other everything that's on our minds. Don't go, Anita. Please don't leave me. Whoa! <laughs> 
Oh my god, we finally escaped. Yeah! <laughs> fuck you, Amelia! And fuck this bitch! <laughs> Bushy ass eyebrows, fuck you! Wow. Seeking a connection with others is a sign of weakness. It's running away. The strongest animals don't form groups. They act alone and need only themselves to survive. Those who betray themselves to fit into a group are pathetic. There's no beauty in living like that. But I don't really mind. I just want someone to understand me. For those I love, and for those who love me, I want to keep moving forward and never look back to 18-year-old me. Wow. Wow. This game was really confusing. Um, I guess it was okay. I'd give it like a 5 out of 10, you know? 3.5 out of 5. Uh, the first half was really shit. I don't like the character that we played as. I really don't. She was like more than half of the game. She was poor oh me. You know? Moving day. It feels kind of scary leaving my hometown, but I'll be fine. I have my best friend with me. I thought you killed yourself. <laughs> ah, shit, Will I? No, stop! Uh, uh, fucking cut to the part where, where the music's off. So, what, they're gay? I'm still confused. Well, that was fun. Uh, fucking Netta. She... I don't know. I, I, did she send the chick who killed herself, like, death threats? And... Because she, she was getting jealous of her friend making another friend? It's still super confusing. Um, What the fuck? And what was the whole thing with, like, the chick's brother touching her? Like, not touching her. Like, looking at her or something? I don't know. Uh, you know, that's gonna be it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I'll try and make more content and put it out there more frequently. Uh, you know, if you did enjoy the video, you know, please like, subscribe, all that. This, uh, yeah, that's about it. Alright, see ya.